Hey, Holden Wright here. If you're an HP Reverb G2 headset owner, this video is for you. For those not already aware, the HP Reverb G2 were shipped with a production defect where the HMD screens black out after hitting a certain high volume. You basically have to be deaf to even notice the issue, so this isn't a concern or issue for many and is not a deal breaker if you're considering buying the HP Reverb G2 by any means. I still highly recommend this headset. When I first received my G2 back in September, I did stress test this defect by playing Pistol Whip at 98% volume. At very high volumes, the HMD screen goes black, but then it comes back. Regardless, this is an issue that hopefully will be fixed by HP soon. The Windows sound settings seem to do nothing unless you lower the overall system volume. In the meantime, until HP releases a fix, Reddit user MatthewV1988 found a workaround that works great. I also wanted to shout out Reddit user Pyro for sharing the settings that I'm also using and have tested and can proudly say that I've experienced zero blackouts since using this application. And now you too can enjoy your HP Reverb G2 at full volume. Now let's fix it together. Before we begin, step 1, plug in and power on your HP Reverb G2. Step 2, download the APO equalizer. Extract the package and run the installer. On the pop-up configurator, make sure that you select your HP Reverb G2 speakers. It should look like this. Speakers Realtek USB 2.0 Audio. APO will be installed. Select OK. This dialog can be reopened anytime by launching the configurator.exe in the installation directly. directory. Click OK here, and then hit Reboot Now. After you reboot your computer, Launch Mixed Reality Portal, and then navigate to the Install folder where you installed Equalizer APO. By default, it should be in your C, Program Files, Equalizer APO. Double-click and launch the Editor application. In the Equalizer APO Configuration Editor, we're going to change the following things. On the right-hand side, 125 here, we're going to put as negative 6. We're also going to do the same for 40 as well as 63. Once those are entered, press enter. Your graphic EQ should then look like this. Then go to File, Save, or click the Save icon right here. Next, you're going to go to your search bar and search Configuration Editor. Click Open File Location. This will open the file location for your Configuration Editor and you will see the type as shortcut. And this is what we want because we are plan on adding this configuration editor and equalizer APO to automatically start at system boot. So now go to Windows and Windows key and click R and search shell startup. Press enter. And here you have your startup items. Go ahead and copy the shortcut for the configuration editor into your Windows Start Menu programs. And then go ahead and close this. You've already saved your Equalizer APO, so you can close this as well. And you should be good to go. Hope this video helps fellow G2 owners. If you've ever experienced a screen blackout in the HMD when playing a video game or anything at high volume, this will hopefully fix that issue. So. Drop a like, comment below if it worked for you, and share this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.